Hey guys, Jay here, and recently I've been getting a lot of questions about uploading images, files, and scripts to the Google Cloud Compute Engine server. So in this video, I'm going to show you two ways to upload files to the Compute Engine server, one of which will work for multiple files, and then I'll tell you about a third way to upload files, which is the best, but is super complicated to set up. The first way is to open up your SSH window on console.cloud.google.com and click the gear icon. From there, click Upload File, choose a file, and click Open. This works fine for a single file, but would be extremely inconvenient and impractical for uploading multiple files. The simplest way to upload multiple files is to go to your file explorer and create a new folder. Put the files that you want to upload in this new folder, and then zip the folder and upload it in the same way that you would upload a single file. Note that even if you cd to a different directory in the terminal, the files are still uploaded to the root folder. If anyone figures out how to change this, please let me know down in the comments section. I will show you how to move and unzip the folder once they are finished uploading. In the meantime, I will tell you about the third way to upload files, and that is with an FTP software such as FileZilla. This allows you to easily see and interact with the file system with a GUI. Currently, I'm FTPing into my web server, and you can see my PHP and HTML files. I can also open up folders to see my CSS and JavaScript files. From this GUI, I can right-click and edit files, or drag and drop files to transfer them to or from the remote server. This is the best way to transfer files, but the downside is that it is extremely difficult to set up. It involves generating secure keys and installing multiple softwares. I think that I have FTP set up to connect to the Google Cloud server on my laptop, but I will need to refresh my memory before making an instructional video on how to do it. Now that our compressed folder has been uploaded, we can move it by typing move images.zip and specifying which directory we want to move it to. Then if we cd to the directory, we can unzip it by typing unzip, followed by the name of our compressed folder. Now we can see that we have our images uploaded. Unzip was installed by default on my machine. If it is not installed on your machine, you can install it by typing sudo apt git install unzip. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please give it a like so that more people will see it. If you'd like to see more videos like it in the future, go ahead and subscribe so you'll be notified when I upload. As always, have a great day. I'm out.